New at five, Cincinnati's former fire chief suing the city, the mayor, Aftab Purval, and city manager Cheryl Long. Michael Washington filed that wrongful termination lawsuit in federal court this morning after his surprise dismissal just last month. This uh, experience has been literally devastating for him and his family. Uh, he's devoted his life to the Cincinnati Fire Service. Former Cincinnati Fire Chief Michael Washington heard rumblings among his ranks, but his attorney says he never saw his March 24th firing coming. He had been assured a short time before his termination that his job was safe. Um, and so, yeah, it did. It was blindsided. He was blindsided. In response, Washington hired Steve M. with Finney Law Firm. M calls the former chief a loyal public servant and says that he was dismissed after nearly two years in the position, despite being given no prior warnings, reprimands, or being put on any performance plans. We don't believe that that firing was legal, essentially. Um, after he had been with the fire service as chief for six months, uh, the city did not have the right to just get rid of him for any reason. They had to have just cause to fire him under the city charter and they did not have grounds to do that, we don't believe. We reached out for a response today, but a Cincinnati spokesperson said the city does not comment on pending litigation. However, at the time of Washington's firing last month, we were told the decision was made due to a concerning workplace culture that is unwelcome towards women. City manager Cheryl Long issued a statement saying, I want to be clear that I do not tolerate discriminatory, hostile, or unfair working environments in any city department. An accusation, M says, simply isn't true. I think it's a remarkable thing that Chief Washington has been with the Cincinnati Fire Service for 30 years and has never had a single complaint of harassment or inappropriate behavior or discrimination made against him by any employee for any reason. It's not in his character. Uh, Chief Washington is a remarkable man and a good man. Now, M says the goal of the lawsuit is to restore Washington's good name in the community. However, as far as returning to fire service, M says that that would be difficult and very unlikely. They're also seeking damages for all the lost wages and benefits, as well as the emotional distress. He says that this is caused for the former chief and his family.